hello feed farms welcome back to my channel okay so come on it's weekend get away welcome to greece it's summertime all right so i will be showing you the country from my own lens okay join me on this trip weekend family get away all right so we are on our way to a villa and we're going to just chill there and spend all the day and um, be returning later in the evening all right so here we are we are at the villa we're just trying to pack properly and then go right into the villa okay so here it is and there's something about greece if you're thinking about visiting greece there's something about this country you have so many options depending on what you like what you prefer okay so if you're someone that you want to stay in um, a villa you can rent a villa if you want to stay in a hotel you can get a hotel okay and another thing is if you love like hotels or villas that are close to the beach where you have the view of the sea you know you see the ocean and things like that you can get those if you're someone that you want to be closer to the mountains and have all those mountain and valley beautiful views and things like that there are numerous options for you so for example this is one of those this villa is actually situated up on the mountains so you have very beautiful view every morning you wake up you just sit down just enjoy yourself and the villas and hotels they go you know they vary the price range you don't have like a particular price for every hotel and villa so for example like this one goes for 50 euro per night like for a night you will pay for about 50 euro if you want to stay in this particular villa okay it is beautiful i will i uh, will try to give you a 360 spin so just watch this video till the end okay because if you're someone that you're looking to visit greece this will give you like a clue of where you're going and what you should be expecting and things like that and please if you have any questions for me leave it down in the comment section below like i said there are hotels and apartments just name it whatever you want it they have it here in this country okay so <laughs> just prepare yourself if you're visiting greece this summer or next summer or in three four years whenever you're preparing to just visit greece just have it at the back of your mind that there are lots of places that you can stay and you just depend on what you can afford they have very affordable ones they have ones for like celebrities you know uh like uh, people like will smith and um his wife Chada Pinkett, uh, people like the Kardashians, you know, and all those other Hollywood celebrities. When they visit, they have like top, top, you, you know, that they pay a whole lot of euros to stay. So, yes, they have from the ones that are for common people that don't have so much to hotels and villas for celebrities so they can have their privacy. Like this one here, if you're here with your family, you know you just have your privacy you have the pool you have uh, area to uh, grill you have a place to make your to cook something make coffee you have they have a swing out there that you can just relax with your partner if you uh, if you have kids you can sit there they, they have like swings that the kids can swing and have fun there's just so so much to do uh, you can rent a car and just go around if you look right behind me from where i'm standing right now behind me you can see the mountain tops and there's just so many things to do if you're visiting greece okay and actually this island is called island of crete they have so so many islands so just do your research and pick any of the islands that you feel best suits you okay because all the greek islands are beautiful they don't have one that you will go to and you will leave feeling sad or disappointed you feel like ah all the videos i saw online and things like that were not really same with what my what i saw or my experience when i got there all the everything you will see online when you get there you will even be wowed like oh wow this is even more beautiful than what i saw online okay and they are also very friendly people they are very nice so don't even stress about oh i don't understand the language and this they will try their best they don't speak so much of english but they will try their best to give you the best service 
and listen to you and try to understand what you're saying okay so don't even stress yourself come visit greece trust me you will not go back the same well we were just here having fun swimming um and eating like uh, fruits here and chilling for the weekend actually the owner of this um, particular villa happens to be a friend like a family friend so we're here just chilling for free okay it's not paid <laughs> we're chilling there he's also at the beginning of the video when we were entering he was the one that was opening the gates the person that opened the gate for us was actually the owner of the place uh, right now no one is there at the place but it's booked already okay that's one thing with Greece one week you're looking at places hotels and um, restaurants like places are empty and the next week you come to ask for space and everywhere is booked and it's full because people from different parts of the world they just book for different months different weeks so whenever they come into the country they just you know take a um, your vehicle and go straight to whatever hotel or villa that they're supposed to be staying at okay so this particular villa also is booked so just let me know do you love Greece would you love to visit leave me a comment below and if there's something you want me to do a video about to talk about something you want to see you would like to know about the country let me know also leave me a comment below that being said we're just here having fun and just enjoying our day and something else i want to mention if you're visiting greece this summer just get prepared because it is hot okay i'm telling you this week we have like 40 degrees here in the country so it is not even a joke if you're coming from a country that is very cold then i think it would be really nice for you you know like changing okay you will struggle but you will really enjoy it like okay living a cold place and just being in a place that is warm not just warm but hot okay people are even struggling to sleep you know it is even the wind during the day is hot wind you know when you know some, sometimes when you're you're hot inside you just want to go out to the balcony sit down and just receive fresh air i'm telling you this fresh air that is blowing this period is actually a hot fresh air there's something like that <laughs> so yeah if you're someone that you don't like heat so much prepare yourself because we have 40 degrees here in greece this month of june okay normally summer period summer seasons in greece is always very hot i always used to say that that it is almost as hot as it is in uh, some parts of africa you know the the um temperature it's very similar in summer seasons it, it gets so hot that sometimes i used to ask myself oh wow <laughs> is this europe i used to think europe it's all cold 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 but i really love the weather in greece because even their winter it is not dead cold except in um, certain areas of the country like um up north like if you go to the northern part of greece yes they get a whole lot of snow like up to the door level and you know like yeah they're like shoveling snows away from the uh, pathway and trying to clear route to drive and things like that that happens up north but other areas of greece they get snow but not so much and for example like crete the part of crete that uh, this part of crete it's hard to actually see the snow on the streets that they drive you have to go like special places like omalos they have a place they call omalos that's like up on the mountain if you go that's where you're going to see snow during the winter period and you know have all these um games fun games that they do with snow and all that like you have to go to special places to see the snow but okay you have you can see few on the road you know in front of your door but yeah it is not that cold like that's what i'm trying to say like it's not that cold compared to some other european countries the weather here is wonderful i guess that's why so so many people just love visiting uh, greece before the pandemic by this time june everywhere is packed everywhere all the hotels there will be no space the roads uh, every the restaurants bars every 
summer um, areas, shops or businesses are open, everywhere you go to, it's full. If you go to the swimming pools, you might not even find space to get in the water. Uh, for sure, you're not going to get a seat to sit down. So you're just going to stand by the bar side or look for a small corner to just drop, keep your towel and your things while you go in the pool and you won't even find the space to swim it's just like everybody's just standing in the pool and you know bending down dipping in and coming right out and just having a conversation drinking and listening to good music if you go to the beach also all the sun beds are taken the sand people are lined up like seals <laughs> i always say that right so yes yeah, so it, it is always very busy but because of the pandemic this season it's not so busy this summer is not so busy you just have few tourists anyway that brings me back to our weekend getaway that we're here having fun and just chilling okay so here my little madame as i always call her if you've been on my channel before you know i always refer to my daughter as my little madame because she likes doing her own thing when she wants to do them so yeah she has been swimming running around the whole compound enjoying herself and now it's time to sleep so this is me checking out